you guys, it's me again, in case you guys don't know who I am by now. My name is Matt, and welcome to Hilton's Computer Repair. Now anyways, we got a very special tutorial for you guys today. We're going to be showing y'all how to use BitLocker on Windows 7 Ultimate and Windows 7 Enterprise. Keep in mind though, this could also be used on Windows 8 Pro and Windows 8 Enterprise. So that being said, let's go ahead and get started with this video. So, the very first thing we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and go to the start menu. And we're going to type in BitLocker. B-I-T-L-O-C-K-E-R. And we're going to go to BitLocker Drive Encryption. Basically what this program does is that, say you have like a flash drive, and if you're afraid to lose it, like I lost mine once, and I had important stuff on there that I didn't need people to see, uh, you could go ahead and lock it with a password and a bunch of other stuff. Basically it's going to make your flash drive a lot more secure. So, this is the flash drive that we're doing right here. It's the little D drive, so you're going to turn on the bit locker. And just, you're just going to go ahead and wait right now for it to start up. And it's going to tell you what you need to do from here. We're going to go ahead and use a password to unlock this drive. I'm just going to type in whatever password comes to mind. Okay, once you got that, retype the password. And then you can also use a smart card, but for this tutorial we're just going to use a password. Go ahead and click next. Okay, okay so basically you're, it's going to pop up to this menu right here. Now, pretty much what this mumbo jumbo is telling you right here is, uh, say if for some reason you forget your password or if you lose your smart key or whatever, uh, you could actually save a recovery file, and I totally recommend it if you guys are extremely forgetful like I am. So we're just going to go ahead and save the recovery key to a file, go ahead and click on the first one. You can also, have, you can also print out the recovery key if you want to, but I'm just going to go ahead and save it, and I'm going to go ahead and save it to my desktop just so that way like I'll know where it's at. So go ahead and click save, and I'll go ahead and delete it later on if I need to, because I really don't think I'm going to be forgetting this password. It's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0. Now, we can go ahead and click next, and this is where the fun code, this is where the fun part starts. Are you ready to encrypt this drive? Yeah, I'm ready to encrypt this drive, so let's start encrypting. Now it's going to it. Okay, now the encrypting process will begin. Now, depending on the size of your flash drive or whatever device you're using, it may be a little time consuming, so just uh, go ahead and let it run, go ahead and do whatever it is you need to do, go ahead and break the leaves, I don't know, make a sandwich, watch a movie, uh, go exercise, do whatever it is you need to do, get off your computer and go exercise, have fun, there's a giant world out there just waiting for you to see. So basically, this one's going pretty fast because it was only like 256 megabytes from back like in... I don't know, 06. For some reason, I still have it. If you have like an 8 gigger or maybe even like a 64 gig one, it's gonna take a long time. Maybe about like 20 or 30 minutes if you're using about 64 gig. So, this one's already halfway done. I'm just gonna go ahead and let it finish, and I'll come back to you guys as soon as it's done. Okay, it's already like at 90 percent, so I'm just gonna let it play. And I'll just go ahead and wait for a few more seconds. Good! The encryption of your D drive is complete. So we can go ahead and click close, and we can go ahead and exit out of this. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go into the computer. Now, see this giant lock key hickey on the flash drive? So, this is what it looks like right now. But, I'm going to go ahead and unplug it, and this isn't recommended. But I'm just going to go ahead and pull it out of here because this thing is worthless anyway. Now I'm going to go ahead and plug it back in and watch what happens. Wait for it to boot up. Check it out. This is automatically going to pop up every time that you plug in your flash drive. All you got to do is just tap in the password. And then if somebody tries to go in here and look it up, try to bypass it, it's still going to show you guys to put your password on. You can play on the C. I kept on trying to do it, it didn't work. But now I'm going to go ahead and type in my password. And now it's time to unlock. 
Okay, now it's unlocked, and now we can open the folder to view the files, and there is actually like no files on here. So I'll just go ahead and do a little image, two of them, little files that we need, a bunch of files that we might need, and then we might want to play with okay. Now I'm going to go ahead and safely remove my drive, because I don't want anything bad to happen to it. Gonna reject it. Wait for it to reject. Push the save. Okay. Now I'm gonna pop this baby back in. Okay. Now I'm gonna type in my password yet again. Got it. And here it is. Now you can open your folder and view the files. And if you have some very important documents on here, like maybe like a timesheet for work, something with your first and last name, like a, an essay or a school report or something. <laughs> maybe your social security, if you didn't remember it, or for some reason you wrote it on a file like this, or if you have some kind of documentation that it has it on there, uh, this will 100% protect your drive. Well, maybe 99.999% for the most part. Well, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to Helsin's Computer Repair. Thank you guys for all your likes and your views. And spread this around to all your good buddies out there because we love making friends. So from all of us over here at Helsin's Computer Repair, we will catch you on the flip side and I'll see you in the next video.